Okay, so first thing you need to do is go to metamask.io and download the metamask extension for chrome it's basically a software wallet on which you can store various tokens um, directly on your computer and this allows you to easily connect to the dexes and trade um, trade that way so first thing you need to do is download metamask on metamask.io once you download it you'll have the little metamask extension right here and this is what it's going to look like um, i have a few accounts here but you'll basically ask you to create an account a wallet address it's going to give you a unique address um, and then you're going to have that address to which you can send funds to so you're going to create that wallet address you're going to jot down the safety security words and all that good stuff when you create it and then you're going to go ahead and go to binance purchase bnb binance coin um, based on how much you want to how much cake you want to buy because we're going to swap the binance coin for cake so you're going to buy let's say you want to buy two thousand dollars worth of cake you'll purchase two thousand dollars worth of bnb Binance coin on Binance, and then we're going to send that BNB to your MetaMask wallet, okay? Because Binance coins don't actually run on the Ethereum mainnet, we have to switch down to the Binance Smart Chain mainnet. So on the top here, you're going to have an option to do that. We're going to switch our MetaMask wallet to the Binance Smart Chain mainnet, and you can see that we're now denoted in BNB as opposed to Ethereum. Then you're going to take this wallet address, whatever it may be, you're going to copy it, you're going to go to Binance and you're going to send your Binance tokens, your BNB tokens to this wallet address. When you send them to this wallet address, this is going to update with your new balance of BNB. And now you're ready to swap that BNB for cake. Once you've done that, we're going to go ahead and go to pancakeswap.finance. And this is the DEX. The DEX is called PancakeSwap. I know it's kind of silly, uh, but this is the DEX on which you're going to buy cake. So once you go to pancakeswap.finance right here in the top right corner, it's going to ask you to connect your wallet. You're going to click on that. You're going to select metamask and then it's going to connect your metamask wallet through your browser extension automatically and over here you can see the wallet address that has connected um, so this is the wallet address the bnb balance is 2.5 bnb and the cake balance is zero right now so um, now that the wallet is connected again you can see that up here you want to check and make sure that the address that's connected actually matches the one that you created so you can copy and paste that and make sure that it matches but once you have your address here with the uh with the right amount of bnb showing here you can then go to trade and click on exchange and this is where you're going to swap your bnb for cake so this is showing that you want to swap what token for what token you want to swap bnb for cake so i'm going to search for cake right here click on that and now it's going to show your BNB balance. You're going to decide how much of that BNB you want to swap for cake. Let's go with max. And then it's going to automatically calculate how much cake you'll receive for this amount of BNB. Over here, we're going to get 51.8 cake for 2.5 BNB. It shows you the exchange rate as well. And then you're going to hit swap and you're going to follow the directions after that. Confirm swap. It's going to open up your MetaMask browser. It's going to charge a fee to make that swap. This is the fee. This is what it's going to cost. You're going to hit confirm. I'm going to hit reject right now, but you'll hit confirm go through that process and then you'll end up with cake in your metamask wallet again this is the metamask wallet that originally had bnb in it we're going to end up with cake once we make the swap once you have cake in your wallet you're now holding cake it'll be stored on this online browser wallet you can access it anytime you go on your computer and then if you want to stake the cake to make that 90 percent apy you can go down here to pools and right here this allows you to stake your cake um, and again, I told you that pays like 90% APY. It's actually 87 right now. This rate will fluctuate over time, but it has been quite high for a while now. Um, and you want to go with the auto cake. And what that means, it's going to automatically compound your profits and restake those profits so that you don't have to do it manually. If you do it manually, the APR is lower because it's without compounding. This is the APY because it's compounding. So you can choose to do manual cake as well. And that means that whatever rewards are earned, it's not going to restake those. Um, in this case, you can see that my profit since I've staked cake is $2,800, which means that if I wanted to today, I could withdraw these uh, profits and I could sell the cake that I made. So it's made me 114 cake through staking at this rate of return. I could withdraw this cake today if I wanted to and then go sell it on the open market for $2,800. I'm obviously letting mine compound and continue to grow, but that that's the option that's there. Um, and then you can manually stake if you want as well. There's a small fee here, a 2% fee of all your cake profits every time it compounds so that's where the where the the, the con is um, so you can manually stake that to avoid the two percent fee but this allows me to not have to worry about this and log on every every week or so to restake and this just does it automatically for me at an 87 percent apy i believe that includes the fees i think 
um, but the fees are generally pretty negligible. So that allows you to stake your coins and make that APY on top of just letting the coins appreciate. So the coins, again, trading at $24 for cake right now, I expect that to be over 100 within a matter of months. So on top of the price appreciation of the coin, you're also getting this free interest rate, essentially, um, just for staking the coin. So that's, again, also on the DEX, which is pancakeswap.finance. At any point in time, you can withdraw your stake. You can unstake withdraw your profits along with your original investment and then you can go and sell that on the open market just by going back to trade going back to exchange and then swapping your cake swapping your cake that you have for usdt which is a synthetic us dollar you know what usdt is and you can just cash out anytime you want and then you can send this usdt to binance convert that to us dollars and then withdraw to your bank account so that's pretty much the process um, if you have any questions or need any help with anything just let me know